longer contestant. I don't know. I, I think I should talk to Grandma herself. Hmm, maybe we should. Hello, Grandma. Stopping in for a rest? Just a quick drink, and I'm back out running. Say, I wanted to ask you something about your history with the race. You did? Why? I was wondering, how long have you been running in this race? Why do you care? I was just talking to the guys here, and we were wondering how long you've been running in the race. Well, it's been a good long time. I've been running in this race for years and years. Couldn't you tell us exactly how many years you've been in the cow race? No. Do you not want to tell us how long you've been in the race because you're afraid we'll figure out how old you are? My age is none of your business, Phony Bone. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, that's all I wanted to ask for now. Finally. I'm gonna skip that drink. I need to get back to my warm-up. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Who did you say you were gonna bet on? Well, something Grandma said when you were talking to her did kind of throw me. But I'm sticking with it. Hey, have you heard about this real fast cow that everybody's talking about? I'm sticking with Grandma Ben, even though... Well, I'm sticking with it. I'm telling you, you should take a close look at the signs of Grandma's aging. She did say something odd before, but come on. It's Grandma Ben! How long has Grandma been running in this race? I don't know. I remember her always being in it. Exactly. Does Grandma eat less than she used to? Not really. One day last week I saw her eat two whole chickens, a loaf of bread and a watermelon. And then she had lunch. Right, well, uh, they say you need more food to keep you going as you get older. I've been noticing that myself. Does she come to town less than she used to? No, more often, if anything. Um, right, well, sure, you know, getting older makes you lonely. You should think about scouting around for a younger contestant. Nah, except for that one thing she said, Grandma Ben still looks good to me. Oh, that running sure must make you thirsty. Not specially, but it's good to stay hydrated. I think I'll head inside and wet my whistle. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Let's discuss this again later. Bye. Hello, Grandma. Stopping in for a rest? Just a quick drink, and I'm back out running. Let me ask you something about this year's race. Well, okay then. Make it snappy.
You've been doing an awful lot of running this morning. Nah, I barely started. I've only run about 15 miles so far. How far are you planning on running before the race? Oh, maybe 50 or 60 miles, just to warm up. Seriously, Grandma, I think you're gonna wear yourself out before the race if you run so much. Fiddle-faddle, that's just a warm-up. Why do you care, anyway? So, Grandma, who do you think is the fastest cow out there? The fastest? Oh, I don't know. There's a lot of good-looking cows this year. A lot of good-looking cows, huh? Are you nervous at all? Heavens no. I'm not worried about winning the race. I just go out to have fun. So you'd say you race for fun and not to win? That's right. I would. You're not gonna try to win the race this year? I'll just do my best. Not gonna try to win? That's very interesting. Actually, I had some questions about your farm. What kind of questions? I heard something about some kind of scuffle at your farm. I'll thank you to drop it, phony bone. It must have taken a lot out of you. Drop it! You sure you're feeling all right? You seem a bit edgy. Hmm. Not feeling well. That's very, very interesting. Okay, that's all I wanted to ask for now. Finally. I'm gonna skip that drink. I need to get back to my warm-up. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Who did you say you were gonna bet on? Uh, what was this cow you were talking about? No one knows the cow's real name. They call it the Mystery Cow. Yeah, put me down. This sounds like a real winner. You won't be sorry. Hi, Phony. Hey, Phone Bone. Say, you don't look so good. What's going on? Oh, it's just Thorn. You having girl troubles already? Girl troubles? Of course not. What are you trying to do to impress her? I don't know what to do. I've been working on my manliness. Manliness is not the way to go about getting girls. It's not? No way! Manly men burp and show off and leave the toilet seat up. Women don't like that stuff. What women really want is money. You have to prove to them that you can take care of them. What you really want is money. Somehow I don't think Thorn's as greedy as you are. Where is Thorn anyway? She's just walking around the fair with some other guy. That's not so bad, is it? Your girl walking around the fair with another guy is kind of bad, yeah. Well, forget it, okay? It's probably nothing. We'll walk around the fair tomorrow instead. Was there something else you wanted before I got back to work? Well... You need more girl advice? Maybe. Trust me on the money thing, it's not about greed, it's about financial security. Find her something that represents your generosity and affluence and she'll be yours in...